Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying five salty snacks. These were sent to us from Maria in Berlin, Germany, so thank you very much to Maria. Mine are both the Funny Frisch brand. I have the roasted bacon style pestle chips <coughs> and the currywurst style chips. And mine are elephant brand, I guess is the brand. This is the gourmet burger, honey mustard and sriracha cheese. They look like pretzels. They do, they look like uh, Snyder's of Hanover. Yeah, so much, yeah like broken up pretzels. So we'll see if that's what they are when we, we get to them. They sure look like it. Okay, so Maria says, this is my cheat sheet for Maria. She said, I gave you the Funny Fresh uh, Kettle Chips Roasted Bacon a second chance because what happened was she sent these to us before and the bag like opened up in transit and they were all over the place and so she bought us more. Uh, hopefully they will not open during the journey again. They did not. Uh, Kessel Chips are kettle cooked chips that come with 151 calories for a handful, 30 grams. They have a smokiness. I wouldn't necessarily have said bacon, but I definitely would have said there's smoky, smoky ham, maybe bacon. It reminds They're me, smoky. this is gonna, I don't know if anybody will understand what I mean. It reminds me of baked beans, <clears throat> of bean and bacon soup. No, oh, yeah, I can mm. see a little bit. Literally, it tastes. Because it has that smoky flavor that they put in that. Yes, so it tastes like I've eaten a bowl of bean and Campbell's bean and bacon soup. That's the, that's the aftertaste. Which here. is my favorite, my favorite soup. But now, I don't know how I feel about it in those chips. chips. It's not one that I would want all the time. Yeah, there. It's a different chip. It's. Mm -hmm. yeah, I like it. Yeah, it's and not it's bad. And it's one I would eat for sure. But I wouldn't get that all the time. I wouldn't be one I'd go to the store and buy all the time. And because the chips I think are, I would get tired of it. The chips are a little hard too. They are, but they're kettle cooked chips. Yeah. Well, they're not crunchy hard, they're just hard. These are the curry worst. Yeah, these are scary to you a little bit. I was looking for them for a long time because I really wanted you to, uh, to get a taste of them. Curry worst is a typical fast food and iconic for Berlin where it originated. Make a lot of noise, so I don't want to do it over you. You know what? Okay. Uh, basically, it is a sausage with a tomato sauce and a special curry flavoring that is slightly spicy, slightly hot, slightly sweet, and traditionally served with a bread roll or fries. 30 grams are about 160 calories since they are not kettle cooked, but fried potato chips. So that's why they're more calories, she say. No. They smell that. You can smell the tomato. Okay, so sausage, tomato. Okay, so it's these? <laughs> these. These. The red ones. Um, honestly, I get, <coughs> excuse me, I'll get a, uh, a tomato pasty kind of flavor with some other seasonings in there. I'm assuming that's the curry and the, I don't get the sausage flavor with them. Mm-mm. I don't mind that. Mm -mm. No. Now, like I said, it's very tomato. There's a picture of it. Oh, yeah. I don't mind that. That's what, that's what they're supposed to be. I can see eating those little sausages with some fries. Yeah. Uh, um, it depends on how strong the curry flavor is. I know, because it looks like they put a ton of power on those. That, you know, we just have not been raised with curry. Mm -hmm. No, it's and, not something we I, eat over here. I know there's different kinds of curry and, and different levels of it. It's just not something we're used to. I do not mind it, but I would absolutely go to, there's been so many other chips from Germany that I would rather eat that I probably would never choose those. No, no, but if you if you eat that kind of stuff all the time anyway, I'd say then that represents it pretty well. That. Yeah, and I would definitely try that meal. I wouldn't mind uh, trying that meal at all. Yeah, especially if they gave you a sample of it. Like yeah. a sample, or like you have this and a couple other different things, you uh -huh. can try it out and yeah. you can see, I don't really like that, I don't like this, and you can eat more of it. Yeah, because it looks good. It's just all depending on how much of that seasoning mm -hmm. they put and on it. We there. both like sausages, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Elephant. The elephant pretzel pieces are super new in the German shelves and actually made in Romania. 
They are coming in three flavors that are all written in English, so you can read them easily. <laughs> um, Thank goodness. I give you the calories for the whole bag, though. So which one are we trying? The burger? burger. The gourmet burger is 622 calories, but that's for the whole bag. That's not bad, though. Ew. They're very big hunks of pretzel. Mm. I'll tell you what, if you ate too many of those, you would get sick at your stomach because they're so greasy. I do have a little oil in mm -hmm. um, oh, You know I what I get out of the flavor? What? It tastes like I've had a grilled hamburger. Yeah. Like a, a, a something on, a, on the grill on the fire. But I'm telling you, they're very greasy. And I don't you, think they're too greasy, but they are. They no, are a little bit. but they are a little bit. And if you ate that whole bag, I can see getting, I can see me because i go overboard eating and eating and eating and eating because they are so good and the crunch is good they're not i don't think they're as hard as Snyder's they're not ever. they have a nice soft they have a softer crunch yes they're softer which like the snyders are really really hard and they'll start to hurt the roof of your mouth mm -hmm. this is much softer mm -hmm. than that it i is. i like this this more i like the flavor it's very smoky mm -hmm. grilled meat kind of flavor yeah this actually is actually more of it's not even a meat flavor really it's just the grilled like the charred part of the hamburger yes. not the actual hamburger in itself yeah it does taste charred i like, I like that description yeah. Uh, this is the honey mustard. honey mustard. It is 626 calories for the whole bag. Which They're is like all close. One of my favorite Snyder's is the honey, honey mustard. Honey mustard, yeah. I don't think I had ever eaten those before I met you. I had never eaten Snyder's Panover. I had never eaten a combo before I met really? you. No, no. I hadn't tried a lot of things before I met Kevin. And then Kevin was like the snack king. Combos are like a staple. I don't think I'd ever had them. Those are good. They're not as strong mustard wise. That's why I like them more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like the stronger mustard flavor. The Snyders of Hanover are so strong yeah, I've ever that seen. you you eat a couple and it's immediately going to be on your breath and you're going to taste it for hours. I actually like this a lot more because it's not as strong. Yeah, and I tell you what, you really get the flavor of the pretzel in there too. Yes, you do. And it's a good pretzel. Whereas the Snyder's of Hanover, I like them, but all your you, you don't taste any of no. the pretzel. You only taste the seasoning. Yeah. And I like that that you taste the pretzel. I like them, mm -hmm. but I just want people to know they're not as strong. So, yeah, these are really good. Yeah, this is the sriracha cheese, and it is 625 calories. So Marie said these are really, really new. Um, I bet you she hasn't even tried these herself. She may have bought a package of them. You know she I'm may not. have. I, I would be curious if she if she has, or if she's waiting on us. Hmm. I get that vinegary kind of sriracha flavor immediately. Now I like sriracha, but I don't like that sriracha. I'm going to take one more bite. They come across as sweet almost. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's the cheese mixed with it. it. It is. I think it's the fake cheese I don't like. Mm -hmm. Or it comes across as fake. Because I get a little bit of the sriracha flavor. You get a little bit of that uh, that vinegary kind of flavor. Then, the, then it, the rest of it's kind of funky. That's, oh my gosh. I was just getting ready to say. It tastes like funky cheese. Yeah. It's a funky cheese flavor. And I, it's too much funky. <laughs> Um, and I don't like that funky cheese flavor. Yeah, I, if they'd been all, if they'd been just sriracha, I think yeah. I would have liked them better than the sriracha cheese. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't, I don't like it. Yeah, exactly. If they had left out the cheese completely, then it would have been perfect. And they're not really hot. I mean, you get a little. I no. mean, a very, very, very light tingle on the back of your tongue, but that's it. Yeah, I think anybody. Could anybody eat can those. eat those, literally. Um, I but, wouldn't want to, but anybody could. Now, I think my favorite's going to be different than your favorite. You're probably going to pick the burger. No, I'm gonna pick the honey mustard. Oh, honey mustard is my favorite. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, but, the charred flavor I like, but I wouldn't want that charred flavor all the time. I like I, either one of these, the honey mustard or the gourmet burger would be my favorite. I would never buy the sriracha cheese again. I don't mind the sriracha cheese, I could eat it, but I wouldn't choose to buy it if I had other choices. But Maria, if you haven't tried any, we would recommend the honey mustard to you and see yeah. what you think. Or the burger, the burger's got that yeah, charcoal. Yeah, the burger's that, nice too. That charcoal kind of flavor. Um, these two, 
out of the chips. I would pick the bacon out of the two, but honestly, I wouldn't pick either one of them There's because other flavors. I know there are there are other flavors that we like so much more that I would just leave these. But I appreciate getting to try them, and we'll uh, we'll have to let Andrew try them as well mm -hmm. when he's over here. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.